Welcome to Christmas, motherfuckers. I have my notes up on my laptop so that I don't forget what to say, because... When I film YouTube videos, I always forget what to say, and then it's just like a big fat mess and everything goes wrong, so... Something happened and made me a really smart-ass bitch, and I came up with the idea to have my notes on my laptop next to me. So that I don't forget what to say. If you're wondering why I look literally insane or like a fucking orange, it's because I faked tan the night before, and clearly it went very wrong. Basically, I couldn't be bothered to like exfoliate or moisturize before fake tanning, and those are the pretty much two most important steps to getting a nice, even fake tan. So now I just look like a patchy ass chlamydia riddled shit stain. So let's just try and move past how fucking crazy I look right now. Also, if you're wondering why I'm going to be talking quietly in these editing clips, it's because it's 1.36am. Oh my god. That means it's Christmas. Merry Christmas, motherfuckers. And if I wake my parents up on Christmas at 1.36am because I'm editing, my mother will literally end me. If you hate Christmas, this video is for you. If you wake up on Christmas morning and then remember that you have to spend the whole day with your family, even the nan that criticizes your every decision, this video is for you. Don't look at my hand. <gasps> is that the neighbor? Is that the rude bitch Karen that told me to be quiet when I was playing Mario Kart? Bite her. Okay, I have a confession. This didn't actually happen, but you know what did happen? I was walking my dog and so was Karen at the same time and her little sausage ass looking dog tried to bite my dog. So fuck you and your little sausage, Karen. Look at the window, look at Karen. I don't know if her name's Karen, but she looks like a Karen. Why are you shaking? If you wake up on Christmas morning, grab all your Christmas presents, open all your money and then scatter back to your room and just lay in your bed disappointed thinking, well, fuck. What do I do now? Then this video is for you, then that's right. I'm here to comfort you on this day of depression. Pebble, stop licking my fake tan, it's disgusting. That's probably not good for your intestines either. I literally hate Christmas so fucking much, I'm such a Grinch, so I thought I would save everything Christmas related and just mush it all into one video so I don't have to say the C word, Christmas, in any of my other videos, because I don't want to just, I don't want to spread that depression across the rest of my channel, so that's why I'm making this vlog, everything Christmas related is going to be in this vlog, Christmas vlog, eh. Is my dog okay? Like, Pebbles. You good, bro? Basically, once this vlog is done and over, we can stop thinking about Christmas for another 365 days, or however many, however fucking many days it is till Christmas. Christmas fucking sucks. This Christmas is gonna be the next big fat family gathering since last Christmas, and I've done a lot of... I've posted a lot of... I've done a lot of weird, concerning things that my family are gonna be... Judgmental, concerned about. I'm not looking forward to being judged and roasted by my entire fucking family on Christmas Day. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so the next thing I had planned for this vlog was to go Christmas shopping, and I am still gonna do that, but not right now, because right now, I'm actually running late because I was watching Victorious in my bed all day. I found a fucking vegan Nutella at the supermarket, and shit. Shit goes crazy in my stomach. That shit's fucking amazing. Basically, I'm getting really fucking fat again, so that's what I'm gonna do now. I'm gonna go to the gym because Sweetie is gaining weight. Sweetie needs to lose a couple of hundred kilos. They just wanted to get in the shower, scrub it up, shave, shave, shave. I just hit you on the nose, I'm sorry. So because I'm already running late enough, let's give you guys a little fucking ring tour because it's December and every December my life literally falls apart. My mum tells me to clean up every day and I've somehow avoided it for two weeks. I don't know, I've never avoided cleaning my room that long. First things first, we have this face mask that's just sitting on the floor, a used face mask. And if you flip it over, you'll actually see that the gooey old face mask, can you even see that? <laughs> That was just sitting on my carpet. My mom's gonna fucking kill me. Then I have my Doc Martens, which actually have a tea stain on them. Okay. Use chocolate wrapper. Then I have a mug that I was having tea in, and it actually has my nipple tape inside. <laughs> that tape was literally on my fucking nipples. Then I actually have my nipple tape, which I'm gonna be wearing to the gym right now. Then I have my penis light. Then I decided to step up my winter fashion game and buy a beanie, but it actually just makes me look like an uncircumcised penis. Um, so yeah, I think that's all I have for this room tour. December room tour over. Oh my god, wow. That fake tan is truly something else. What am I fucking talking about? Next club you're gonna see is gonna be me Christmas shopping for my family. I'm currently at the mall hiding in a little crevice. Looks like people don't see me vlogging because I just tried vlogging and someone yelled across the fucking mall. Yeah, vlog it, bro, and I was like, ugh.
I hate humans. Anyway, I would really rather not be at the fucking mall right now. I'm only doing this because it's society standards to buy your family presents on Gizmas. Like, Gizmas. Ugh, I fucking- that's- I hate Christmas. I fully thought I had another, like, three ass weeks to do Christmas shopping, and then I saw a meme on Instagram, and it was like, Christmas isn't a week, and I was like, oh, fuck. So now I'm out Christmas shopping. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck I'm gonna get anyone in my family. We actually have an issue, we actually have a problem, like there is an issue. We have a challenge and I bet you guys are so fucking thrilled right now as to what the challenge is, but I'm broke. I'm literally so broke so that everyone in my family gets a $5 budget gift. Because I can't afford over $5 on anyone and you know what, it's not my fucking fault. My life is falling apart and I'm broke, okay? If my family wanted good gifts from me, they should have just given the money to me to get them the gift because like, sweetie, it ain't coming from my bank account. Now people are kind of like looking at me because I've been standing in this crevice hiding from the public for like three minutes. So let's get Christmas shopping, bitch. Ah. Okay, I'm gonna try and smash out all the middle-aged women in my family first. I'm sure I can find like candles or something for under five dollars. I'm currently standing in the tampon aisle. What the fuck? Okay. Who the fuck charges $15.99 or a candle? What? Are these people actually on drugs? I can afford the candle holder, but not the fucking candle. What? Oh my god, I fully was just planning on getting every middle-aged woman in my family a candle. Now what am I gonna do? I could get them exfoliating gloves. I've been Christmas shopping for literally three fucking hours, and to put a long story short, no one's getting any fucking Christmas gifts this year. In case you're wondering what my outfit, Christmas shopping December, Christmas shopping outfit is, here you go. <laughs> Christmas cookies, Christmas vlog, in the style of veganism. Oh yeah, they're gonna be vegan. <laughs> oh, so this is probably gonna go really badly, um, because we don't cook. We're also missing like two ingredients. <laughs> <laughs> what ingredients are we using? Um, well, the recipe says we have to use all-purpose flour. That I'm... was usually a big part when it comes to baking. Yeah, but I asked the baker at the supermarket, I was like, is all-purpose flour the same as normal flour? And she was like, no, and I was like, I guess then I just got normal flour. <laughs> We're using the wrong flour, and it said to get almond extract. We're just gonna use vanilla. So what did they actually want? All purpose flour. Yeah, but like, what the fuck is the difference? And then we're gonna decorate them with like icing. I'm not even in the frame. <laughs> then we're gonna be decorating them with icing if my mum doesn't come home and actually kick us out the kitchen. Cute. Oh, thank you. I made them myself. <laughs> Maybe we should mix the plain flour up with, with the self right now. Are you on crack? <laughs> We're missing an elite. Um, how do I describe this? We're, we're missing the chef elite. We we have an elite. Wow. My face is elite. They probably can't even see my face because of the lighting. We're That's missing bad. an elite. We have a friend group and we call ourselves. Oh no, we can't even say it. Oh yeah. We're Basically, like the elite nans. <laughs> nans. We nans. call ourselves the elite because we are elite to all other human beings. <laughs> Me neither. I have an apple. Oh, not that booze. Oh, it does smell like alcohol. I love you, I don't touch it. Yeah, we don't drink alcohol. Alcohol is for the week. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I completely scammed the supermarket. They make you buy reusable bags at the supermarket. That's good. Yeah, it's like good for the environment, but not for my bank account. How much are they? Like 30 cents. Oh, it's nothing. That's a lot for me. That's a hefty, that's like a good bag. Yeah, it is, but basically I didn't pay for <laughs> it. Because I went through the self-checkout and I didn't scan it because Oh, you're one of them. I'm one of them. I'm a friend of the criminal. And then I also only charged myself for one apple. <laughs> the machine started beeping because oh. it was like the weight doesn't add up one apple when I had four apples in here. And then the lady came over and she was like... <laughs> oh! <laughs> How are you on the Christmas scale? Do you like Christmas? I actually really do enjoy Christmas. That's a shame. A lot. That's a shame. Okay, you probably should have already preheated the oven. Preheat the oven? Yeah. That's gonna make a noise and we're gonna have to talk over it. Oh, then don't. No. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, literally, that almost snapped off. I really hope that was also slightly <laughs> on <laughs> <laughs> oh my On better things, it says cream the vegan. 
It says cream the vegan. <laughs> Why are we creaming the vegan? I don't usually look like a drowned rat. I always look like a drowned rat. That's like what you've got cookies on, right? Baking tray? Oh no, we don't even have a rolling pin. What are you a rolling pin for? A roller. Oh, we don't. But we don't have a rolling pin, but I'm sure we can find something thick and round to... Kind of vegan butter and sugar together, and then I feel like Ari. Do you feel like Ari? Yeah, you know when she um went on Jimmy Fallon, she did the Wheel of Impressions. Oh, wait, and she's she like, can't reach. Like, picking it up, picking it up, another 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 another
Wish you were married. <laughs> we ended up designing them. I have a Christmas okay, tree. Let's, what is this? What is my cookie? Here. Now we're gonna give them a taste test. Okay, ready? Steady. Oh, wow. <laughs> What went wrong? Why would eat these? When it melts, it's better. You have a bicarbonate soda problem. I feel like she comes through sometimes, like in random ways. Like... <laughs> the icing definitely saved it. It does help. <laughs> oh yeah. I see what you mean. I just got a throat full of bicarbonate <laughs> soda. Oh. Oh, I just got a mouthful of salt as well. I like the salt. Okay. Bye.